Hey loves, so today I wanted to share a little bit of my fall style with you and today's video is super special because I'm going to be featuring my collection with Society Plus. I wore all of these looks while I was in London for UK Plus Size Fashion Week so I also thought I would give you a little behind the scenes of what happened there and yeah, we're just going to get into my fall style. My first outfit I actually modeled in Fashion Week and I'm kind of practicing on the runway in these clips. You can see the skirt looks really, really bright red under the stage lighting, but it's a little bit more muted and dusty in person. It's almost like a soft maroon. So I'm wearing that beautiful maroon tulle skirt with a crop top that is also for my collection. The two of them together give a dressy vibe that I don't feel is over the top and I also paired them with my favorite pair of Charlotte Russe heels that I think give them an amazing, amazing edge. This is an extremely special outfit to me, but I absolutely love the way it looks on. Tool skirts can seem scary, but they're actually very wearable, and who doesn't want to feel like a princess on the daily? My next look is a little bit more casual. I am wearing the taupe cardigan from my line. We also do have this in black with my super cozy and warm plaid scarf, and I just paired that with jeans and boots for a very autumn feel. To finish it off, I wore my favorite watch because I love the look of watches over sweaters. I loved this next outfit so, so much that I wound up wearing it for my press event at Fashion Week. I had so much fun at the event and I got to chat with some amazing people in the fashion industry. It was just a really great day in general. I love how this floral blouse looks with this purple skater skirt. It is so, so cute together and I wound up wearing my skirt pretty high waisted so it's a little bit on the short side. But you could just wear it lower on the waist if you did not want to wear leggings or tights or anything. I paired mine with black tights and again I have that floral blouse tucked into it. I think it gives it such a soft and romantic feel. Since there's a lot of color, I kept accessories neutral with a brown pair of Oxfords and my favorite brown bag. I love to pair red, white, and blue together all times of the year, so I tucked my red, white, and blue top. This is kind of like a super soft t-shirt Henley into this ditzy floral navy skirt. My skirt does have pockets, I'm obsessed with said pockets, and I just wore that over a pair of super soft leggings. My shoes are a pair of wedge booties that are incredibly, incredibly comfortable to walk in, and I kept them taupe to kind of bring a fall vibe to this look. And I kept accessories simple with a brown belt, my favorite brown watch, and a pair Pair of stud earrings. Okay, quick segue, I got stopped so many times on the street while I was wearing this look. I even met a few of you guys, which was amazing. Thank you all for saying hi. And I even got to shoot in it with my friend Leah, who I adore, and she is incredible behind the camera. The whole look felt very low-key sex in the city to me, like Carrie and her big tutu moment, and I'm just super into it. I wanted to make this pink tutu a little bit more wearable for the daily, so I just paired it with a gray v-neck t-shirt that is plain. I think it looks really cute. The pink on the gray is an adorable combo. Here I am wearing a killer pair of heels because to me, go big or go home, but I think it also looks really cute with flats. This tutu is super special because it's really well made. It has a slip underneath, so there's like no sheerness to it. And because it comes down to right about knee level, it's not too short. I'm super into the tutu thing. Do not knock it until you try it. They're actually very easy to wear and I think they're adorable. I saved my favorite look for last. I'm obsessed with this rust colored shift dress. It's so soft and breezy and comfortable that I paired it with a floral crown. I think that I got this one from Beautycon to give it kind of like a woodland fairy vibe. On bottom, I'm just wearing a pair of wedge booties. I'm obsessed with the detail on this dress. It has little ruffles at the very hem. It is a slight high low, but it's nothing drastic. It's a truly beautiful piece and I love it for fall, but that's gonna do it for me. I really hope you guys enjoyed this lookbook. I know a lot of you were waiting to see how I styled my collection, so I hope that this helped you. I will have some little outfit of the days and other lookbooks with other pieces from the line. For now, I'll have a link below if you want to shop, and I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you have not already, and until next, my loves, I love you. I love you so, 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 so much, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.